Welcome back, Empower Tribe. You made it. You made it through the day. You made it through your Friday. But I hope today, I hope this Friday, your mindset has changed from YOLO to YOGO. Not you only live once to turn up whenever you want, but you only get one life to live out your purpose. Did you think about that today? Did you sit down and think about, man, I don't have another, today is gone. I don't get another chance at this day. I don't get another chance at the opportunities that were presented to me this day. I don't get another chance at the advantages I could have taken advantage of this day. It's gone. And all I can ask and pray and hope for tonight is that God blesses me to wake up tomorrow so that I can do better and take advantage of tomorrow so that I can take advantage of the opportunities that might be here for me tomorrow. Did you think about that? Are you ready now to put down a life of pleasure, to no longer allow pleasure to drive you? And remember what we said, if, we, if you missed the video this morning, click the link in the description, go back and watch it. Pleasure isn't just the feel good temporary things. We gotta put that down too, because all that stuff, all that stuff we do on the weekends and after work and everything is time is wasting our time. It's distracting us from the goal that we want. We're losing focus. But pleasure is also just being satisfied. It's being content, even in a place that we don't want to be, even at a job that we don't want to have, even in a car that we don't want to drive, even in a relationship we don't want to be in. We're not uncomfortable enough to hurry up and get out of it. So we, we find pleasure there. We're satisfied. We're content. But my hope for you is that today you realize you no longer want to be driven by pleasure. You want to be driven by purpose. That same energy that you woke up with this morning. It's Friday. Let's go. The weekend's here. Thank God. Another woo. That's the same energy that you want to strive for to have every single day because now you're not exchanging your valuable time for someone else's dream you're chasing and pursuing the life of your dreams you're living out your purpose every single day you're waking up trying to see how much better you can be and how much more you can become how much more you can do how much more you can learn how much more you can love and how much more you can give. And when you get to that point, every day is a Friday feeling. Every day you wake up thankful for another day. Every day you wake up excited with intensity and energy and intention. You're motivated. You're ready to go. You wake up saying, let's grow. Because you know today you're going to have opportunities that you didn't have yesterday. And opportunities that if you're still here tomorrow, you won't have tomorrow. So you're going to seize them. You're going to take advantage of them. And you're going to do whatever it takes to hit your goal. To live the life of your dreams, not someone else's. I hope that that's where you came today. And if not, go back and watch this week. Go back and watch yesterday because we're trying to get with this or we can get with that. But this is where it's at. Positivity, commitment, letting go of all of the things that don't serve us and holding on to everything that's going to pull us to the life of our dreams. That's what I pray for you. Because you deserve it. You were created for it. And it's waiting on you. It's waiting on you and it's not going to stop waiting for you. But you have to step up and start taking action. You got to start moving forward one bite at a time, one step at a time, one push up at a time, one dollar at a time, one forgiveness at a time, one gratitude at a time. You only get one. So if you don't remember anything else, always remember this. It's a great day to be alive. It's a great day to be great. And it's a great day to find the greatness in you. Now go out there and live the greatest day of your life.